Hello guys, Keeper on TV here, uh, back for yet another transfer video. I'm trying to bring you guys the latest transfer news surrounding Birmingham City Football Club. And there's been a report um, from 35 minutes ago, manager struggling to meet Newcastle's demands for the 29-year-old, and we all know who that is, Carl Darlow, the Newcastle goalkeeper who spends on loan last season at Nottingham Forest, I believe. No, it wasn't last season, was it? It was probably the season before that, sorry. But he has played on loan for Nottingham Forest. So, um, according to The Sun, Carl Darlow is on the radar for Birmingham City. Of course, Lee Camp left on a free transfer after he refused to sign a new contract for the club. He didn't want to be a number uh, two goalkeeper, so fair play to Lee Camp. Um, so, it's been reported that Birmingham in the Championship are interested in signing goalkeeper Darlow from Premier League side Newcastle. The report, um, the report in the British tabloid um, that Newcastle wants a transfer fee for a permanent move or a loan deal with extras. However, according to the report, Birmingham manager Ito Kroenke is struggling to find the funds to meet the Mag Magpies' demands. Well, how much has he actually been given then? How are we struggling to meet Newcastle's demand? How much do they want for Cardalo? Cardalo, sorry, leave it down in the comments below. How, do you, how much do you think they want for him? Of course, we definitely need a goalkeeper. The season started about three weeks' time now, and we've got a game against Spurs in less than two weeks. So we need to get, you know... It's just a crazy situation, isn't it? We haven't got a goalkeeper. How can a club like Birmingham City Football Club be in this situation? We had four goalkeepers a couple of seasons ago, but now we don't even have one. We have one in the under-23, that's about it. Um, it's just a joke. Meanwhile, the Sun has claimed that Fulham... And no, one, well, no one cares about that, do they? Um, so, yeah, what is your thoughts on this? It's hit a stumbling block. It's definitely not good news. I would have took Cardalo. You know, we can sing the song at St Andrews as well. I mentioned it in my previous video. But, yeah, I, well, I tied on my previous video, Cardalo to blues his arm. But, you know, it's hit a stumbling block, like I said. And, um, you know, you've got to question how much is Cranker actually being given, though. If we can't get... If we can't get the funds together to sign Cardalo, a second choice goalkeeper for Newcastle then I don't know I really do not know um, but of course this is only a report I'm just reporting you know the transfer news I'm not saying this is 100% it, it could be fake we, we don't know do we? we we could not we could be after someone else but there is other options to Carl Darlow there's Neil Everidge that a load of people have been talking about from Cardiff um, I would definitely take him uh, Joe Hart was one of my options that I would have took at St Andrews, but of course he's gone to Tottenham Hotspur to join Jose Mourinho. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this transfer video. Sorry the videos are not that really long, you know. Um, there's only If there's load, loads of transfer news to talk about, then the videos will be longer. But there's been no real news as to happening um, the transfer in the transfer window so far for Birmingham City, of course. Um, a lot of other teams have been doing business, but we've only signed George Friend. That needs, you know, that needs to check. We can't just sign George Friend and then, I mean, obviously we're not going to do that. But what I'm saying is we need to continue doing our business because, of course, we've got to, like, the sooner we get the players in, we can, um, you know, field them in pre-season, um, get their confidence going and... Um, and they get to know their teammates and that. So it would be much better if we get our business done early. Um, traditionally, it's always better, isn't it? Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Keep right on.